Hi, this is Suchi and today I am going to show you how to use the fourth rule in conditional formatting that is color scale. So color scale is very useful when I want to, I want to see which is the lowest value or which is the highest value or which value is how much close to the lowest or the highest value. And I just want to do that by looking at the data by looking at the color in which it is highlighted in. So how to do that? I just need to select this, select the range where I want to apply the conditional formatting. And then I'll just go to conditional formatting and I'll select color scales. And here we have different options, different color palettes to be selected. So let me select this one, which is green, yellow, red color scale. And if I apply that, it will apply the gradient here. And by looking at this, I can see that these are the, this is the highest value and these are the values which are closest to the highest one. And this is the lowest value because this is marked in red. And all the values which are close to this one will be in a red shape. And as I'm using random function here, this is getting changed. So let me just paste it as values. Now it won't get changed. Anymore. So if I just select this one and I want to sort, sort it based on marks. So I will go to the data tab and I will select sort. Here I will select marks. Make sure that this header option is selected because our data is having header and then I will say largest to smallest. Then I will say OK. So as you can see, the highest value is having green and the values which are near, which are close to this are having a lighter shade of green and then, then it is moving towards yellow and at the end it is going to red. So let me change any one of these values. Let's say I'll make this 85 or I'll make this 76. So you can change, you can see the change here. So based on the value, it will change the color. Uh, this is giving us a clear visualization of the value. Now, if we want to change this, if we want to edit this rule, what we have to do is we again need to go to the home tab and go to conditional formatting and we will go to manage rules. And here, if we click on this rule and we will say edit rule, we can have this option to edit it. So here, as you can see here, three color scale is selected. I can also select two color scales. And it is by default selected as lowest value, highest value. And this color, let me select it as maroon and it will get changed. So this can be customized as per our requirement. So in that case, even if, even if our data is not sorted, we can get a overview of the whole data just by looking at the color. So when our data is not sorted also we can see we can just look at the data and we can understand which is the maximum and which is the minimum data which is a minimum value. The same rule we will apply on this petrol red. We will just select it and we will go to the home tab. We will Go to the style section and select conditional formatting and we will apply colors, color scales. And this time let me apply red, yellow, green color scale. And as you can see, this is how it looks like. So just by looking at the data, we can get an understanding, get an overview. So this is it for today. Thank you for watching and keep implementing.